Welcome to Vanguard Motor Sales. We specialize in buying and selling high quality muscle cars and classics. We get in new cars every day, so our inventory is constantly changing. If you'd like to go check out our website right now, we've got over 150 cars in stock. Hit this button up top. If you'd like to watch an About Us video, hit this button down at the bottom. Now let's go outside and check out what we've got for you today. All right, we're out here with this beautiful Roadrunner now. Hey, if you're catching us on YouTube and you want to see about 100 pictures of this Roadrunner, go to our website at vanguardmotorsales.com. We're going to put it up on the left. We'll take pictures of the underneath side, in the wheel wells, in the engine compartment, in the interior, in the trunk. We will show you everything you need so you can make a really good choice on your muscle car investment. So come on up, let's take a look at this baby. Take a look at the chrome on the bumper, it's beautiful. They've refinished the grill, all the aluminum looks good. Of course, this blue paint is just popping in the sun. All that metallic is sparkling. And I tell you, to spray this metallic like this, you've got to be a professional to get it on there nice and straight. And this car looks gorgeous. Good looking wheels and tires on the car. Take a look at the way the body fits together. Everything's nice and flush. The gaps look even. The stainless up here is in great shape. Check the operation of this door. Take a look at the jam here. The lips on the door are all beautiful. I'm going to grab the keys while we got the door open here. Take a look at that quarter panel. That thing is long as a bus and straight as an arrow. Beautiful job on the bodywork. Kudos to the guy who did it. Let's get in this trunk. Well, it looks like we might have the original radio there. And there's a carburetor in here. Let's see if I can find the numbers here. It's an old carter. Well, obviously this, oh, there it is. It says uh, E84426S. I'm sure all you Mopar guys know exactly what that belongs on. Looks like we got a spare in here. The um, wheel wells are in great shape. Take a look under there. The floor is all nice and painted. Everything's beautiful inside the trunk. Let's uh, shut this down. Shuts down nice and tight. And look down the passenger side. She's straight as an arrow. Check the operation of this door. Nice and beautiful here also. And at Vanguard Motor Sales, we're not consignment dealers. We spend the time, we check the cars out before we buy them. And then when we get them back here to the shop, we've got a 130 point inspection sheet we go through. And the purpose for the inspection sheet is so when you call Tom at 248-974-9513, that helps him answer any questions you may have about the car. So please call Tom and ask him anything you need to know about this car so we can put this dream in your driveway. Let's check out the interior. Take a look at that beautiful door panel. Armrest looks good. The chrome on the armrest is beautiful. The strip here looks great. The crank, the door jams look great. Steering wheel's in great shape. The dash is in awesome shape. Take a look at the seats. Absolutely beautiful. If these seats um, are new, they've been in here for a while. They've got a tiny bit of age to them. And there's absolutely no wear on them. The back seat and the seat belts are all there. The seat belts are up front here. The headliner looks good. Even the dome lights working. 
It's a beautiful car, and of course, you see that four-speed shifter in there, guys. All right, we're underneath the Roadrunner now. This thing's really nice underneath. As you can see, take a look at those drop downs. They look all original. Trunk floor looks original. Beautiful exhaust. The gas tank's been replaced. I'm guessing the springs have been rebuilt also. It does have a sure grip in it, and it's a 323 gear. Good looking mufflers. The frame up here is in great shape, nice and solid. The back sides of the rockers are nice and solid. Look around here. The hangers are nice on the exhaust system. Still got the parking brake cable on it. As you can see, the floorboards have got undercoating, but they look all original to the car. Somebody's put some new plugs in the floorboards here, the plastic plugs. Back side of the rocker on this side looks awesome. Both sides look awesome. Take a look, you can still see pinch welds there. How nice and clean it is between the two pieces of metal. Whenever these things start rotting and they, these always swell up, this is nice and clean. Frame up here is nice and clean and solid. Now the trans is numbers matching. You can see the uh, over here on the pad right here. The last four here is uh, 0021, and we know that's the last four on the date. Now the build date on the motor is right here. We've got a fancy dancy little book. Neil just looked it up. The motor was built two days before the car was built. So it does not have the van upstairs. Uh, on the pad, but we're saying that this baby is more than likely numbers matching because this motor was built two days before the car was built. Uh, we do have drum brakes up front. The guys check out all the suspension, um, the steering gear, everything's good. Looks like the gearbox has been off, more than likely uh, either rebuilt or it had a rebuilt one put on or maybe somebody just took it off and cleaned it up. The, um, the block, the casting number on the block is, not the casting number, but the casting date is 4-23-68. The bushings and the sway bars look good. The front frame looks great. The core support here is in awesome shape. It's one beautiful car underneath. Um, looks to be numbers matching motor, definitely on the trans. The rear end's got a sure grip in it. It's got the right gear in it. This car lived its whole life in California. I don't think you're gonna find a better 68 Roadrunner here. Let's check these wheels and tires. All right, after looking a little closer here, the trunk floor has been replaced. I saw some little grinder marks here and everything. They ground out the uh, spot welds. They put a beautiful trunk floor in, and they did a beautiful job doing it. Just about fooled me, and I can see uh, you can see up in here where they uh, split the original floor. Now I've gone over the whole rest of the car. The rest of the car is original, but as everybody knows, on these cars, those trunks always leak, and those floors held water, and they rotted out. So somebody did a beautiful job putting a new trunk floor in. It does look like the drop downs and everything are original to the car. It looks like they split it right here on the seam and put a whole new trunk floor in. Beautiful wheels and tires. These Magnums look brand new. Of course, the BFGs look brand new. We got 225-70-15s. Take a look at the lip on that front fender, how nice and clean that is. Everything's nice and smooth on the back sides, so you know there's been no patchwork. The wheel wells still have the undercoating on them. You can tell there's no patchwork going on up in there either. I mean, this is one solid car. Let's look at the rear wheels. We've got brand new rims on the back also with the exact same size tires out back. Same good looking BFGs. 
Take a look at the bottom of the quarter here. Nice and smooth there. Drop down on this side looks great. Floor on this side looks great. The frame looks great. This is just one gorgeous car here. All right, let's let it down and take a look at that uh, 383 under the hood. All right, we look awesome under here also. Good looking paint on the inner fenders, on the firewall, on the motor. All the hoses are in good shape. Looks like the belt's in good shape. Uh, this 383 runs awesome. Now it's had a uh, Holly carburetor added to it. We do have uh, original type carburetor in the, uh, in the car here. So if that's something you want to do, you want to take the time to rebuild that carburetor and put it back on here, that's, uh, that'd be great. Everything looks nice and clean here. The wiring looks good. It's a beautiful car under the hood here. Looks like the alternator was replaced. Um, definitely been all cleaned up. So it looks like a rebuilt alternator under there. So give us a call at 248-974-9513. It's a beautiful road runner. You're gonna pop the hood of this baby. You're gonna be drawing a crowd. Everybody's going to want to see what's under the hood of this baby. So give us a call and let Vanguard Motor Sales put this dream in your driveway. Let's take this Roadrunner for a ride. She's got plenty of power. Love shifting the gears on this baby. Got my Speedo working down here. The tax working. The radio works. The fan works. Let's see, where's the windshield wipers? Here they are. Windshield wipers are working. Oh, looks like they're uh, parking in the middle there. There they go. Let this guy go. We'll flip this baby around and show you what a nice turning radius it's got. Turns on a dime. Take a look at that. Whip it right around. Do a little speed run here through the curves. At Vanguard Motor Sales, we're shipping experts. We can ship this baby anywhere in the world. Just give us a call at 248-974-9513. And there is no better place to buy a muscle car than the Motor City here. And that's where we're at, right outside the Motor City here in Plymouth, Michigan. We're at 15100 Keel Street. Here's our hot rod shop coming up here on the right. Got some hot rods outside today. Got a cool old Ford truck, cool Mustang. So give us a call and let Vanguard Motor Sales put your dream in your driveway. All right, we've made it really easy for you. Click on any one of these five pictures here and it'll take you right to whatever you're interested in. We're gonna give you about 30 seconds here to click these pictures. If you need more time, just go back in the video and click that picture.